Hey good humans, Jason from Jubilee here at the Jubilee office. I just wanna take a moment to say thank you to the Ridge Wallet for sponsoring this episode. I honestly just got this wallet and I think it's incredible. I think it looks super dope, really, really sleek, super thin, and also really, really durable. It's amazing and it has a full lifetime warranty. It can hold up to 12 cards, which is a big concern sometimes I have with thin wallets and has space for your cash as well. I highly recommend it. I've loved carrying it around. They've got over 30 different options for colors. Uh, you can have carbon fiber, burnt titanium. I honestly love it so much I might get a second one just so I can kind of switch out the colorways. There's also even a 45 day guarantee. So if you get it and you don't love it, you can always send it back for a full refund. So there is no risk. If you use our code Jubilee, you actually get 10% off. Make sure you check them out. And with Father's Day around the corner, this could be the perfect gift for your father, or honestly yourself, or your mother, anyone really. Uh, make sure you check out Ridge Wallet. Thank you again for the sponsorship, and we hope you enjoy this episode. Who's a makeup artist off the top of your head that you like, maybe not idolize, but you look up to? Be Neil. Be Neil. Oh, that was amazing. We brought together seven makeup artists. I am a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. I am a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. I am a makeup artist. One is a liar. If the group discovers who the liar is, they'll split a cash prize. If the liar survives, they win the entire prize. Who? is the odd one out. I was just like staring at everyone, trying to see who was staring at each other. And I was like kind of confused at first of what was going on. I kind of assumed that everybody would be coming in with a full face of makeup. So when Aldrich came in and he didn't have any specific eye look, I'm kind of thinking, huh, maybe he doesn't really do makeup. I felt like everyone was gonna eliminate me right away just because I was definitely a bit extra. To me, it didn't really seem like a professional. It seemed like someone who was just trying to experiment with everything that they had in their kit. Oh, okay, bye guys. <laughs> I felt so sad being the first person eliminated. I don't know what it was. I'd like to know. <laughs> have any of y'all worked with celebrities? Or no. have I have not. Influencers. Influencers. Influencers? Not. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I've never worked with a celebrity. Oh, okay. Who have y'all worked with? Not everybody like knows her, but her okay. name's Yvette. She, she has followers. Okay. Yeah, like okay. about a million. So we'll most of off. you guys okay. are like YouTube. I FX. just do makeup, like no YouTube or anything okay. like okay. that. Yeah. So, gotcha. I mostly okay. work with like exotic dancers and stuff. Cute. Oh, yeah. oh, cool. I do like weddings, stuff like that. So if people have events where they can reach out to me and have me go there, then that's what I do. I hate bridal. <laughs> <laughs> I get this a lot since I'm like extravagant, like with like stuff and like. Do people look at you and then like wouldn't want a natural look because they think you? Yep, all the time. One time I had like this customer, she like, kind of like prejudged me based off like my makeup because it was kind of like yours, like really artsy. Yeah. And her daughter was like going to prom and she's like, I don't want that. Yeah. And I was like, I'm not gonna do That's that. Serious. I always get worried about that because like as a male makeup artist, I always like, okay, well, are they gonna judge me because they don't think that I can, am capable of doing this oh, makeup. Yeah, definitely and then just thing. like, yeah. I'm like, please just trust the process. No, like, just yeah. make trust the process. <laughs> What's like the average price of like a, a makeover if someone just wanted like a natural glam? Mm -hmm. It depends on the project. Yes. I was gonna yeah. say like a hundred yeah. plus fifty dollar kit fee. Okay. Yeah. I'll give you a number, maybe like mm, 200 plus $100 kit fee. Okay, yeah, that's what I was. So I charge 200 Just flat, whatever yeah, 200, it is? 200 but after that, depending on how long it takes, oh. I'll charge extra per hour. And you just do beauty? Yeah, pretty okay. much. I wanted to sound more legitimate, 
but that doesn't really make sense. That would be like a long time doing somebody's makeup. Who's a makeup artist off the top of your head that you like, maybe not idolize, but you look up to? v Manny. That was amazing. <laughs> For myself, probably like Kevin Aquan. Okay. I love Kevin Aquan. Okay. Michelle Fawn kind of raised me, so I, I, I gotta give oh, it to Michelle. Okay. Yeah. I'm really big in like YouTube and like online, okay. so I really like Nikki Tutorials. I was suspicious of Alice because she was eyeballing me since I came in. When she mentioned anything about like YouTube, I was like, mm, okay. There's like some <laughs> issues with, you know, people's backgrounds, so like it's hard to separate the art <laughs> and the person. You gotta shut up now. I was gonna change if I stuck with my first guess. She didn't get voted out in the first round, so I just voted for her again. Bye guys. Bye, Bye girl. I'm feeling sad, but not super surprised. I think that the tension got to me. All right, if you want to continue playing, please raise your hand. This is the eye makeup challenge. You guys will have three minutes to put on makeup on our model, Darren. We will start off with Nikki. Can I hold the products? Sure, you can hold okay. the product. <laughs> How do you press one? You know, we would never normally use a liquid liner on somebody. <laughs> I knew I was gonna get called first too, so I definitely had a lot of pressure put on me in that. I'm gonna have you match me. All right, the black is not pigmented at all. Okay. Cute. <laughs> Hello, my name's Aldrich. I'll be your makeup artist for today. If you can just look down for me. Okay, and if you can look up for me. Cute with the etiquette throw in though. I should have asked if you were allergic to anything, but oh well. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just pack on more color. I only did one eye, which is okay. And I know we only have three minutes, but I just want to see more from him. I have gloves, so I came ready. My time's not going okay. Could <laughs> <laughs> you imagine? I told y'all I work with dancers, like they give me 30 seconds to do their makeup. And I <laughs> Bentley killed it. I think I did the best. I think I did amazing. Hi, I'm George. I'll be your makeup artist today. So what do you do in your story time? <laughs> <laughs> do you model often? You have a gorgeous skin. What is your skin prep like? Water. Just, just water? What do you say? Water, water. water and soap. <laughs> you know, like, that's it, I'm done. Okay, do you mind if I use my fingers on your face? Okay, I'm gonna try to see if I can pick up some more pigment. Okay, so I'm gonna go for like a cute little graphic moment, so a little tapping motion, you know? That's how you apply some shadow. Try to outline this with the liner. Well, my hand is shaking, so. Oh, you're giving it. Mm-hmm. That was really good. So I felt like that was like a good choice to do something graphic. I don't know if maybe I did the worst because I was panicking. Uh, to get rid of the competition. We have a tie between Aldrich and George. Period. That means we're going into a tiebreaker. Each of you is going to get 20 seconds to state your case. So we'll start with Aldrich. 
I'm a makeup artist. I've been working for uh, since 2015. I started at a haunted house, starting doing special effects makeup, and then I decided to perfect my craft, moved here, and then started freelancing. I've been working with OnlyFans people, so I've worked with Bella Thorne, Tyler Posey, Pia Mia, Kid Quill, and I'm still trying to build up my portfolio, but I'm a makeup artist. <laughs> <laughs> So when I was growing up, it wasn't cool to be a makeup artist. So throughout my time and age, I had to originally paint my face inside of my um, room. And as I got older, I uh, learned through YouTube and um, all of my friends were makeup artists. And it's really a creative outlet for me. I love being able to create a new face for myself and other people. I love challenges. I love all uh, facets of the makeup artist. And I'm a makeup artist. <laughs> <laughs> that tiebreaker had me shook. I was like, oh, I'm out. Okay, well, all right. Well, it was nice knowing y'all. Guys. We love you. Love we love you. you. We love you. I'll see you on set. <laughs> Please raise your hand if you have any doubts and if you want to continue playing the game. You're beautiful, but I like totally forgot your story and everything because you were really quiet. Mm -hmm. um, how did you start off? I just remember you saying you liked the Fenty artist and that was like all I got, I'm sorry. Since growing up, I've always loved makeup. So I started with family, friends in high school. I graduated around 2015. I worked at MAC for about three years. I've been doing makeup on people there and then started freelancing there. What lashes do you have on? These are by Dynasty Cosmetics. I don't remember the name, but they're like a more of an indie, smaller brand. Do you have a PR code? No, I don't. Okay. <laughs> you were like, Thank you. No, well, I, I can continue okay. the page. I can continue okay, the page. I was just yeah. asking. I think it might be you because I don't know. You're just so beautiful. I feel like someone else did your makeup. And then my doubt for you is you're kind of asking us questions, so we don't have a chance to ask you questions. I was going to say you can bring back to me, so, shoot away. Well, well can you give us like a like a rundown? Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. um, I started off in musical theater. I was a musical theater major most of my yeah. life, which is why which is why she's like this. <laughs> which like I'm like I would always help like the dancers out with their lashes, and this is not even in theater. And again, like you kind of know about makeup in that way. And then I just kind of decided that was what I wanted to pursue. And what's your favorite part about being a makeup artist? Mine is making people happy and making them look like something that they never imagined they could be. I like giving people confidence that they don't think they have. Kind of building their confidence as well, but just kind of like making their day. Cause like sometimes just talking to them and not even besides the makeup helps build their day. And you it's know. like a little therapy session. Yeah, exactly. I'm a color theory snob. So I love anything yeah. as far as like blending. That's why even like clean skin is my go-to and a just likes to create weird shit. Oh my God, I'm cursing so much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 teacher. Oh. Okay, so yeah, can them all raise their hand? Oh, that didn't work. <laughs> That's the sad part. Now, like we, now we have to vote someone else, so it's like. But I know they're gone. But it's I too know, late. We already, we already told them it was the next round. Again, I'm so sorry. Like, I love you. Like, can we be friends on Instagram, please? Bye. We love you, girl. We love you. So please raise your hand if you want to continue playing in three, two, one. If the light turns green, that means you have voted out the mole and you win. If the light turns red, that means the mole is still in the box and you lose. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> yes! Okay. Woo! Yeah. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> I had doubts on you. I was so nervous. Will the mole please step forward and reveal yourself in three, two, one? Sorry, guys. Oh, oh, so 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 okay, so what do you do? Because I, I had like it. had a moment. Oh I know it. I knew it. You guys, normally I'm what you paint. Did you do your makeup this morning? No, one of my girlfriends did. I but I can do makeup, but nothing like you guys. You guys are amazing. I was obsessed with your eyes, obsessed with your eyes, obsessed with your self. Uh -huh. obsessed <laughs> with your love. Makeup artists are the best people in the world, and everybody that we had here today I could honestly say I could beat my face. It was so much fun. I feel amazing. I thought I was gonna be the first one out because I didn't have any makeup on, and I was like, these people are gonna hate me, but no, I'm happy I won. Woo! Ha <laughs> ha